uh, feeling pretty good and riding high for it was a good result for you. Yeah, it was good to bounce back. Obviously, the previous two weeks were disappointing from uh, our point of view and the club's point of view. So, um, yeah, it was a good win. It's good. What pleased you most about it? Was there a particular aspect that stood out? Um, oh, there's a lot of aspects that go into winning a game footy, but um, I suppose we, we ticked a lot of boxes in terms of the KPIs that we wanted to uh, get done going into the game. And um, if you do that, you generally win more than you lose. So uh, it was nice to do that. Yeah. After two pretty tough losses, how good was it for the rebound get back to the way you were playing at the start of the year? Yeah, I suppose we're um, in a position now as a footy club that we probably hurt that little bit more because um, you're a bit more disappointed after... I suppose uh, poor performances, and that was obviously the case the two previous weeks against obviously two quality sides on a bit of a bigger stage. So um, yeah, it was it was natural that you you want to bounce back, and that's the important thing. We did that pretty well. Yeah. What is it about the Swans, mate? In the past, the, the matchups really haven't worked for them. Yeah, it's uh, it's been a while since we've beaten beaten the Swans. I think the last time was probably the end of my first year, just before we. Uh, launched into the finals back then, so um, it was no different to, to uh, West Coast and um, a few other teams that we've kind of played along the way. Um, I think North and Port were pretty sim similar positions that we hadn't beaten them for a while, so um, yeah, we'll, we'll go into the game with uh, confidence, knowing that we've got to obviously um, play good footy because they, they offer up a, a strong contest no matter where they're kind of positioned in terms of the ladder, but uh, yeah, the boys are looking forward to getting back on our home deck and, and cracking in for sure. I remember in the past, just again, talking about the Swans, that, that match, up, like they're, they're a hard team for you blokes to, to get that new match up on. Maybe that's why it's been hard to beat them, or, or is it just a, a good thing? Yeah, I think they've been a, a quality side for a long time. Um, they've always been, I suppose, pushing that, that top eight for, I, I don't know the last time they haven't really made the eight in terms of my career. Um, they're obviously a quality side, so... Um, they're one of those teams that have pretty strong fabric and, and play a nice, strong, contested brand of footy and um, they'll be looking to bounce back after after a loss on the weekend. They've gone a bit younger this year too as well. Um, do you feel like this is the chance to finally break that trout? Oh, you, you don't look at it that way. You, every team you play, no matter who you're playing these days, it's it's a tough game and if, and if you're off a, a little bit um, and they're on, um, you, get, you get shown up. I think we've shown that in the last two weeks. Um, obviously before the Gold Coast game we showed that that we we'll quite weren't, weren't on our game and, and bringing what we need to bring and we got shown up so um, yeah as, as I said the, no matter who you play these days if you if you off a bit you get shown up. Is that hard to believe that it's been since I mean you, you're right your first year that's 10 years ago like you must have gone into a lot of those matches with not much confidence that, is it hard to reflect on that and think gee it's been a decade since we've Knock them off. Yeah, oh, it's it's a funny. You don't really think about it very often because you generally only play um, the team. Rarely you play more than once in a season, so um, it's not like you're playing them every few weeks and, and the, the kind of the drought continued or whatever. But um, looking back on it, ten years is a long time, and um, we'll definitely be looking to, to change that this weekend. Yeah. Richie, let's be honest. Buddy Frank from London Injury Cloud. It's one that pre-order year. They've won one game. This is a really good Oh, I think, to be honest, where we are now as a footy club, we go into every game thinking they're winnable. Um, uh, the way footy clubs are these days, one comes out, one comes in, and um, obviously he's a, he's a quality player and a superstar of our game, but, um, yeah, it's it's more than just one player. And um, as I said before, they obviously have only won the one game for the year, but um, we know every time you play the Swans, um, you're going to get a tough game and we'll be treating it no different. So. But as I said before, there's nothing better than playing uh, home home games in front of your home fans, and um, that's what we're looking forward to this weekend. Can we take from that? I mean, it's almost every week. We're going to go, oh, you haven't beaten this team for so long, you haven't beaten this team for so long. Does anyone hold the tears for you blokes anymore, the way you play? Um, oh, you, you've got to respect the opposition, absolutely. But um, if you're going into games with, I suppose, fear and, and you're on the, on the, I suppose, back foot a bit, you're, you're naturally going to play a bit that way. So you've got to, you've got to go in with confidence. You've got to respect, obviously. We've got to respect teams who are playing and... Um, but have that confidence as well to play, when, knowing that if we play the way we want to play and our, our kind of best footy um, has shown we can match it with, uh, with the best teams. Right, how, how has that confidence taken bit 12 months ago or 24 months ago? Yeah, it's, it's been building, that's for sure. Um, and I think that's what's been the biggest thing um, Fags and, and, and the coaches has, has instilled in, in us as players, that 
um, if we do, if we tick this, this and this, then it's going to go a long way to uh, the final result. And we knew that on the weekend. We knew the Gold Coast were a, a, a side that um, has, a, has a crack at the footy and you just got to keep keep banging on the door and it's not going to happen in the first first or second quarter. It might take to the last quarter and um, we've kind of had that, that mindset um, for a while. So it hasn't just been this year. It's been something that's built over the last kind of 24 months. How's yeah. Logie? Yeah, he's fine. He's... Uh, I think he's, he's probably scheduled in for a bit of a lighter day, um, but he's playing good footy and he's important for us down back and um, we all love playing with him. So, um, yeah, I think it's just part of the old age. Oh, no, he was fine. Yeah, yeah, he was fine. Um, I was chatting to him over the weekend and he was he was fine. I think he's copped a bit, a bit worse than that over his time. So, um, yeah, he'll be fine. Just one on your own form, Richie. Um, you obviously played really well the first six weeks and your captain came out before the season started and highlighted you as a player he thought might have a big season. Like, why do you think that was? What, is there anything that you did in the pre-season or anything extra that you did? Uh, no, nothing extra. Um, I don't know, to be honest. It's, I, was, I had a really good pre-season last year and was looking forward to, to, uh, to attack the season and I hurt my ankle pretty bad round one, so um, that set me back a bit. But... Um, to be honest, it's it's I suppose the, the team's a bit more synchronised in the way we're playing, and naturally, when when the team's going better, individuals are playing better. Um, and I suppose on the on the back, I'm just a bit lucky that I'm playing down back, and there's a little bit less ball coming down there, and um, you've a bit more time to set up behind the ball and all that that type of stuff. But um, yeah, it makes make makes our job um, as as a back seven, especially to be a bit more synchronised and and work the way we want to work. And um, I suppose on the back of that, you, you naturally. Look, looks like you're playing better, but um, it's on the back of the team playing better, to be honest.